Chinese people. Yes. In German. Yes. <laughs> what should I say? Okay. Good talk. Good talk. Rachel. Rachel. Yeah, I, I have uh, two, two things in answer to what you were saying. First of all, it's very good that you brought out this topic of attacking the director. And we are not attacking anyone. <coughs> like, we had some trouble with these questions that were written and answers and stuff. But the whole time, we, we, we really believe that we are, we are not fighting against uh, the director or anyone. And about the point that why do we address her and we don't address the curators, it's a, it's a practical term because the curators, like on Monday, they are probably flying back to Poland. Yeah. And yeah. we won't, and for us that we still, we will stay in Berlin, we would like to continue working in this, in this place. Yes, but uh, Joanna and Arthur are still working as maybe as curators. Our okay. contract is until end of August. No? Yes, and, and yeah, our also for the next people or the okay, next but teams. This is very good information for us. We, we will take it on account in, in the summer. In the summer. And uh, also, what you say that uh, you don't expect the Occupy movement to go into an institution. And <laughs> yeah, you're right, but don't forget that this is a public <laughs> institution and it's financed by the Kultur uh, Stiftung, yes, by the German government. Do you address the people from the street that don't know anything about art institutions? And for me, it was very powerful at the beginning when Occupy um, was at the beginning here in Berlin. And they were meeting every weekend in front of the Brandenburger Turm. It was very powerful, really powerful, because people were really interested. They never heard about Occupy, but then they heard about Occupy movement. And so I was very um, yes, sad when I heard that you um, were invited here by no, the BP. My point is, I was also in the Occupy movement in Spain and then here in Berlin. And um, <laughs> the thing is, we took the squares and now we can also take the public institutions because there isn't any difference between this building and the square because it's all from us. It belongs to the commons, that we say, say always. Also, they uh, around the globe, they're making laws that make it impossible for us to assemble. Um, I know of numerous uh, cities, Frankfurt is one of them, uh, where they have just emergency law to make it so that we aren't on the street. Um, so that's a serious issue. So where do we go? But with demonstrations, you're also very powerful. Yes, we've yeah. done a lot of demonstrations here. Exactly. It has been used as a space to gather, to forge the chain of equivalences between different movements to share a lot of information and practices. I was not invited here, I'm a normal artist and I've joined the Occupy movement only because it was invited within this KW. And I know problems of this concept, but I think that besides the problems, there are also great results. For example, now there is a conference going on, but before in the Autonomous University, there was a multifaceted meetings and talks by different people. This is so valuable. The education becomes so expensive. We would like to continue Autonomous University. It's just a small space for meetings and um, develop the political profile of this movement, which is very problematic right now. It just falls apart. I'm not saying it has to be centralized in an art institution, and we have to be aware of not institutionalization, but I think it's very important to have many anchor points in different institutions fighting for our rights and fighting for rights of the people to have cultural institutions to change this world and not to consume expensive artworks owned by private collectors, which would be very, very negative future of this institution. And we are very scared. This is not about inside, outside, because if it's inside, I could tell many things that are not occupied within myself. You wanted to say something, right? Wait. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Anyone that hasn't spoken, would you like to say something? Maybe why you're here? You can speak in a different language if you're more comfortable. I have a question. <coughs> Who is going to decide about, is that true about the project that is um, um, with BMW in the KW, is that true? The what? With BMW, a project with BMW as nächstes or so? Can I say? I heard the Biennale is already supported by BMW. Ah, yeah, okay, it's there. Okay. So this one, no special. Do you mean the BMW Guggenheim Lab? Maybe, vielleicht das hier, kann das um, sein? Nicht, nicht mit dem KW, aber in Berlin. Okay. Aber BMW ist der Sponsor. Sometimes. Not, not always, not every biennial. 
But BMW Guggenheim Lab is nothing to do has nothing to do with KW. Yeah. Okay. I'm very curious. Um, like, despite li without <coughs> without uh, trying to find out who is fault, uh, whose fault is what in any of the problems that occurred by now. Um, do you wish for more horizontality yes. in your institution? Yeah. And what's the problem? What's the problem that is keeping you from making it more horizontal? Um, the problem is that um, everybody should be included. Then you can talk about horizontal structures. Mm -hmm. But if, if you people are going from the team to the assemblers, this is not horizontal. Um, for me, it would be horizontal if every information could come to every everybody from the team. But this is not possible. Maybe not yet, but I And I think the the point is that then you all you say we cannot go to the to the assemblies and also work because there is no time, but. What, what I wish is that you make assemblies here with your workers, with Gabi, you know, not join j just the assembly of the occupiers, no, make your own assemblies yeah, to the yeah. side. Yeah. This is, this is what I think, what I want and what we want, to really, to bring really the horizontally here. We were talking about this team, and we are thinking about <laughs> <laughs> But many people stop working after the yes. Berlin Biennial. It's a very small team after the Berlin Biennial. But are you stay? Yes, but I'm freelance. What is your salary? Uh, my salary? It's 10 euro per hour. Which is... This was actually a phone call from Jan who's also working for Occupy, and he said there are around 350 people maximum in front of the parliament, the Reichstag, and he told us to join as soon as possible when we finish here. So just also about the action, it's not about sitting here. It's here to, to meet with you in an open-hearted way, uh, or with us, to make it an us, uh, to find out. It's uh, to a little bit um, get beyond the structures, you know, um, to be not afraid of structures and not to be conquered by structures. It's mm -hmm. about getting out of the catch, cage, for me, yeah. at least I, I think for many others too, to be out of the cage, to be here, to say, hey, we're here. And okay, if there is BMW, they paid, we give a fuck, you know, okay, they pay for this. And um, there are a lot of things they do which I don't like. <coughs> and I'm st just going to go on with it. And next, in the next minutes, I'm going to be in front of Reister. You know, and um, they're not going to stop me. If you're thinking about doing internal assemblies and uh, more assembly structure, uh, we have people who work on that, who work on how to do it, like guides and everything. So okay. you can invite us, we can tell you everything we know, and then we would like to find out what your experiences are, because we, we never learned it. We try to gather information how to do it and spread it. Mm -hmm. So we have people who work on that, how to do it. How, no matter how small your team is, um, we can talk about it if you're interested. Okay. So we can say that it is possible to practice horizontality in an institution, although its director doesn't want to continue the experiment of horizontality. It's director, what do you say? It's director, Gabi. But I think, I mean, I just, I just really, um, what I was kind of um, missing all from the movement sometimes was questioning or finding out about the institution before you criticize it. I mean, this is really not a rich institution. I mean, everyone yeah. who works here, including Gabi Horn, they, we don't earn much. And Gabi, I think, I mean, really, in all the heads of this institution are fantastic. I mean, they, they are all kind of, they were involved in, in the 68, or they, they know these, they want these structures. And I think it's, it's um, I would have just, sometimes wish that before criticizing it that um, it, it is investigated because it is actually <coughs> not a rich institution that uh, can be criticized comparable to the states for example how it works in the states yeah. or something like that you know and I just um, so I it's the perfect place for